Yeah, because of courses like this, officers will have better training in how to handle active shooter situations as well as receiving training on how to better improve their day to day operations. The training is put on by the Criminal Justice Institute out of Little Rock. Officers here go through a classroom training and active training. Today was a mix of both. In the classroom, officers learn about statistics of shootings nationwide. We spoke to Gravit Police about why this is so important. 10, 15 years ago, we didn't have as many guns on the street as we do now. We, we didn't have many people that uh, have problems with mental health and things like that. Um, a lot of statistics for shooters are they, they have some kind of mental issue. And so that is part of the reason why we're doing it today. Uh, guns are more prevalent in our society but uh, we want to make sure that every student in any building in this district is, is safe. 13 officers are taking part in this course. Some departments represented today are Highfield, Gravit, Sulphur Springs, and Decatur. Sergeant Skagg says it's good for neighboring departments to go through training together because if worse comes to worse, that is who they will be working with. In an event of something like this, Decatur, Sulphur would assist Gravit if we had something like that happen here. To create as close to real training as possible, officers here go through an active shooter training and use soap bullets to really create a sense of what something like this would be like. To really get a sense of what these officers go through, I volunteered to be part of the training scenario, so I put on gear and pretended to be the bad guy. Ready? And I can say that these bullets do pack a bit of a punch and uh, they really do give officers a real feel of what a scenario will be like. It's the closest to reality so they'll be better prepared. Live in Gravit, Chris Swain, 4029 News.